Ladies and gentlemen, just so right here. Welcome to another mini update video. Now today, I am going to talk about a couple of things. The main thing being the ultimate fate of the Doki Doki Looters Club on my channel. Because let's be honest, nobody, nobody's been watching that playthrough. I get it. Visual novels are not that this popular the facility is in range. on my Move channel, and Doki Doki what? Literature Club has just fallen short. I wanted to do all of the available Finally. routes for it, but I just figured that, you know what? My time playing Doki Doki can be spent on playing other games that people will actually be available to watch. Now, even though I said visual novels aren't really popular anymore, it's not Doesn't far. mean I'm not going to stop playing Sunrider Academy. I'm going to continue playing Sunrider Academy because that's a game I actually do like playing. Confirmed. And I'll just continue on that playthrough. And then there are other Sunrider games I want to play after that. So yeah. Right. As Doki Doki, I don't have fun recording it anymore. Like, yeah, sure, it's good to get together with Meme and do something again with Got Meme moved. after so long. But it's, it's not worth it, you know. It's not fun anymore. So I'm going to finish that on my own time. I have a four day weekend this weekend in terms of recording this. So I am going to spend at least a little bit of that time finishing up Doki Doki. What is going to replace Doki Doki, you may ask, because I do like to keep five games in my rotation of shit I like to do. That's a long run. But uh, what's going to replace that is, I don't know if you guys have noticed, well, you guys probably have noticed, but there's a game called Battletech that came out a couple of weeks ago, or I can't remember exactly when it came out. But it came out a little bit ago. And I've been watching Jareba play through it, and I really want to do a playthrough of it myself, obviously. So, you know, story elements are kind of revealed to me, but I want to, I just want to play. You know, I want to play, I want to record it. That's a game that I feel like people will want to watch, and that I'll actually enjoy playing. Double time. So that's the plan. As soon as you see that okay. final video of Doki Doki Literature Club come out, then expect Battletech in the near future. So that's going that that's sort of the way I'm going there. And the reason why I'm doing this, I'm saying this in an update video, not in the Doki Doki uh, video itself, is because like I said, nobody watches Doki Doki, so nobody will like hear about me starting Battletech unless I do it in a actual in a actual, oh hello, in a actual uh, update video like I'm doing right now. So just giving you guys a heads up on what I'm thinking. So that's what I'm thinking. And another thing I want to talk about, it's a little bit minor. And you know, it's not as major as something like Battletech or XCOM. But it's regarding Plant Side 2. Now you all know, well, hopefully you all know, that I am a huge fan of Plant Side 2. I have... Uh, almost, I have 270 videos so far as of the day of recording this. I have 200 and, hey look Archons, 270 vi Terran Republic videos alone of that game on my channel. Will do. So I'm a pretty big, I like Planet Side 2 and I've been playing for quite a while. You know, I have almost 900 hours on record, I can't remember, I had to check Steam. But overall, I have a lot of hours in that game. And it may not be as much as those uh, beta pre-release veterans, but I think I know enough about the game to be able to help new players get into it and maybe help some people get interested, at least in watching it on my channel, right? Like I do get some views, but not a lot of interaction, if you know what I mean, not a lot of comments or anything like that. But uh, overall, I, it's it's a game that I like, and I feel like I can help people at least get interested in it enough to watch my video, to watch gameplay of it. You know, at least check. Okay, it doesn't even have to be my gameplay. You know, you can like watch somebody else play for crying out loud. But you know, it deserves more attention. It's that jewel hidden gem of a first person game that you will not find the experience anywhere else. May you may think you can through like. Uh, you know, Battlefield, but it's its own gem. It's definitely, uh, definitely one of one of a kind. And uh, what I'm thinking is, I could do a up-to-date new player beginner guide. 
by going like, by, uh, you know, explaining the basics of the game, explaining how everything works as you would normally do in a uh, new player tutorial thing. But, uh, and it's just to help people who may be interested in it get interested in it enough to check it out. And I will do, I will go down to the bone, starting from the very lore of the game and why the factions came to be, because I actually do know that, to, uh, to, you know, the how the game mechanics itself work. You know? This is for and you. hopefully that will get some interest in it, and hopefully people will be willing to watch that. If I get a lot of negative feedback about it, then I might not just do it at all, but I, f I feel like I could pull it off. So that's really... Those two things are really the... Oh, hello. They found it. Yeah, that's gonna activate the sectopod and the turin and flashbang and blinding and uh Anyway, uh, for those of you who are wondering, this is not the overhaul playthrough itself. This is just the remnants of my testing back when I was uh, making sure all the mods played nice. This is nowhere near the uh, uh, right. Yeah. Uh, Shut up, bitch. Hold on. Oh, I can fix that. Get out. Anyway, that's really all I want to talk about. So, hope you guys are looking forward to future Battletech. Future Battletech playthrough. That's going to be coming up soon. I'm only going to be able to buy it. <laughs> uh, late game overhaul. But anyway. I probably won't be able to start it this week, but I'll be able to buy it next week on Wednesday. So, uh, yeah. Battletech coming up, gonna replace Doki Doki Literature Club, and I've been thinking of doing a new player, new player guide, you know. Yeah, how to basic or something like that. Uh, something resembling a tutorial for the game that Archon is stunned because sure vortex grenades are really balanced and stuff so uh Hit the armor. hopefully you guys are excited to all that crap i'm gonna stop repeating myself now i should call it here like i said this is not the overhaul playthrough relax only the remnants of what was happening before, but uh, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. And I'm out. Oops.